In this new origin payback, we have been enlightened and enslaved by a superior empire. However, we just repel them, but they may return. This is a challenging origin, starting us with 10 fewer pops and missing some key technologies and an infrastructural disadvantage. However, there is a destroyed battleship from our former invaders we can use to either repair and use to destroy our enemies or turn into the ultimate science producing habitat. In this video, we'll be focusing on military might and repairing this battleship to see how much fun it is and how quickly we can enact revenge on our former oppressors you may be wondering but what about the habitat well in the next video i'll use the habitat instead and compare how quickly and how much fun that path is in comparison to this one so subscribe and turn notifications on so you don't miss the next part here we have the toxic vengeance empire we've gone as aggressive as we can we have distinguished admiralty for more fleet stuff nationalist zeal so we can claim more xenophobe it's really in fanatic militarist so we get more ship firing and no retreat war doctrine and then a few trait picks to actually just help us out fund all of this and grow our empire back to what everyone else is at payback does stop us from being uh super aggressive as you can see, but we do get damage to military superior enemies plus 15%, which is actually quite good if they're all using auto cannons. My settings are the same as usual. You can pause it to see exactly what I'm playing on. We had a deal. They offered us a fair contract, technological enlightenment, be repaid in installments. Within a generation, our planet was transformed into a so-called advanced civilization. Then we read the fine print. To repay our debt, they insist we work for them on an indefinite term. When our leaders protested, the outsiders turned violent. We fought back. We won, though barely, and only after suffering sizable losses. Now our scientists have finally reverse engineered the secrets of FTL travel from the ships we destroyed. It's a big galaxy out there, but sooner or later we're sure to meet our benefactors again. In fact, clicks fingers, we're looking forward to it. It's time to get some payback. Yes, yes we will. So here is the destroyed MSI warship. Um, there's a bit of debris, but it's fine. We do start without techs like the other origins. So we're going to get Corvette straight away. Planetary administration and research labs. It's kind of key to our empire to actually be able to build any former ships. If you did want to play along, the save for this galaxy is in the Discord, which you should join. People host games all the time if you wanted to play with other people too. So we start with devastation at 33%, which is a... Uh, not good. Hey, at least we get less upkeep from jobs. We also get debris fields, which gives us less habitability, more building cost and upkeep. But we get unified purpose, which kind of negates that. We get more happiness, amenities, resources from jobs and unification officer jobs, which gives us some unity. The first thing we're going to do is build a science ship, of course. We need to actually get out of this hole and uh, start fixing this mess. Retrieve the warship. The battle against the alien invaders left our home system full of debris, shattered warships and broken promises. The sheer amount of floatsome cluttering the area has made it hard to develop satellites and to launch spaceships from vengeance. Under the proposed cleanup project, specially designed construction ships will utilize nets to dredge the space in near orbit, allowing us to approach the MSI warship that still looms over our capital. Commence cleanup. We get a project and we do get a first contact protocol we're not really in the state to be super aggressive early on so we're just going to be cautious for now so we need a construction ship which uh will take us a little bit while we wait for that we'll uh get a new scientist uh, totally epic non-lethal or the kingdom of whatever this empire is to be known as emperor of the green nation king of the planets as they complete annihilate of all competition who is a thoroughbred enjoyer and steve's friend albert i mean they've been demoted to a scientist but it's, it's a good job those scientists of our kind so since we already have an energy grid and our pops are ingenious, giving us more energy from jobs, we're going to just start building that so we can start to fix our economy a little bit. It's not looking too good for us. At least we have no regrets. Getting rid of crime on our planet. That's that's all that matters, right? And if you were wondering where all these names come from, such as the planet names and uh, leaders, it's around the Patreon, which greatly helps out fund these videos and starts from as little as a dollar. So check it out. I think we're going to go expansion first so that we can catch up with pops and then prosperity. And we can actually get the construction ship. I should have got it a while ago. Oops. And we can do that special project. Here the debris, my construction ship. Look at it go. Breakthrough research labs achieved. have been researched finally. Wait, our engineering achieved. research gets paused to do the clear up as well. Ugh, that's a bit annoying. We've found a tomb world. Well, it's better than nothing, I suppose. Clear skies. The cleanup operation is now complete with our skies free from debris. Our science ships are now able to approach the warship and safely explore the wreck. Commence 
clean up. So we should probably get another science ship as we do have an excavation site to do and we want to get that done as soon as possible. And now we can go to prosperity so we can get cheaper buildings. I'm going to swap our scientists with the person who was serving. So they're level two just to speed it up a bit. And then we'll just, oh, I don't have enough unity. I should have waited. Oh, uh, oh well. So we do have a lot of features to clear out. On clearing, we can get technology or resources. So we should probably focus a little bit on energy Achieve. just so we can catch up. We've got Corvettes now at least. And we'll found our first planet. Our sensors cannot detect signs of life within the derelict warship. And yet the engines still faintly buzz and machines are at work inside the empty halls. There is a good reason to believe the ship is still operational and attempts to board it are sure to awaken its security system. We must proceed with caution. We get some engineering scientists and this scientist better not mess it up. Let's clear our first ship debris after we get another generate district. Oh, we do have an archaeological list, so we're going to put that on the person excavating just so it's a bit quicker. One of our archaeologists accidentally triggered some still functional security measures left by its creators. As a result, our team were locked out from the station systems for a considerable time before the right countermeasures could be deployed. Unfortunate, we get three less clues. Sentry guns triggered. Our archaeologists working on vengeance accidentally triggered an array of ancient but still functional sentry guns. Several archaeologists were caught in their firing zones. Paddy issues eventually managed to disable the guns, but there were several fatalities. Well, they've got issues, but they're not sentry guns. Minus one clue. Recovered technological data. While clearing the ship debris, a cache of technological data was recovered. We get unity and biodiversity studies. Cool. Is it just the option? We get a bit of progress towards it, which is nice. We we'll keep going for those. Found. And we may as well research that. And our colony's up. It looks like a perfect alloy world. So that's what we're going to make it. Where are our guaranteed habitable worlds? The other one. Literally cannot see it. Oh, I think I found it. We found our desert world. The aftermath of battle. Reclaiming asset. The construction crews are cleaning debris, repairing damage, and securing rooms. Turning the warship that once terrorized our world into a base of operation. Amidst the wreckage, we have uncovered the bodies of the ship's crew. Or rather, what's left of them. What to do with the remains is a matter of public debate. Dissect them for science or parade them through our cities. What would an aggressive empire do? Parade them through the cities. We're not even going to think. We're playing kind of role play what they would do. The unity is probably better. We have a lot of influence or science, whatever it was. Out of warranty, we are going to end illness. That's how the invaders won us over. We allowed them to build gene clinics on vengeance eradicating most of our worst diseases within a generation. Now those clinics are breaking down. Years of intense use causing the machines within to grind to a halt. The proper functioning of the invaders technology is beyond us. Can we reverse engineer it? Or should we repurpose this poison gift into something truly our own? Other empires might possess similar facilities, but asking the Xenos for help would only bring us shame. We can repair or repurpose. We're going to repurpose. We don't like science stats, but the science people habitats. We have recovered technological data from the debris. We get unity and ceramic metal materials, which is level two armor, which is pretty nice. Beast. Refurbished hardware. Our gene clinics may no longer have the power to cure disease, but by stripping them of their components and repurposing them into memorials, we can at least start to heal the scars left by the invaders. But making peace with the past, we can learn to... We're not making peace. <laughs> no, 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 no. But splendid. We get monthly unity plus 5%. And we get this uh, monument, which isn't too bad. We get two naval cap for each job. Oh, no. Why is there an asteroid? We don't actually have any ships. Please do not. I think it's actually... <laughs> no. <laughs> I can only make one as well. It's upgrading. I don't think it's... Please be in Constant. range now. Hit it. Oh, a forge will. No. How could this be? Well, despite that, we have a healthcare crisis. Also, our gene clinics have precipitated a sharp decline in the quality of our healthcare. Genetic conditions and chronic illnesses, all once simple to cure, are once again on the rise, and our median life expectancy has returned to pre occupation levels. Public faith in the healthcare system has reached a new low. And some of our people are even starting to lament the departure of the invaders. Double our investments in medical healthcare or promote it alternative treatments. Hot growth reduction, happiness reduction. I mean, both. I don't want to build a gene clinic. So we're just going to do whatever you want. Get some like sticks or whatever and rub them in your wounds. I don't know how it works. I'm no doctor. All right, let's see if our Corvette will get there in time. Go! Another one's coming. <laughs> it's not. Come on! I don't think 
gonna happen? I believe we're at halfway. Hey, we finished prosperity though. <laughs> <laughs> on the flip side, we'll go with Executive Vigor for more Edict Fund. 3,000. It's not going to do it. If I didn't misclick, we might have saved it. 1,000. Oh, we did it! <laughs> I've never had an asteroid be that close. And we get 900 minerals. Ain't too bad. The aftermath of battle. Analyzing the competition. As we scour the warship's central database, the designs of our former masters have grown clear. The way they approached with enlightenment only to train us to become better slaves. Their well-honed plans and protocols, their calculated lies. Our world was clearly not their first attempt, but rather an example of their core business strategy. Continual analysis, 700 engineering research. Hopefully we can actually catch up with where we should be, and we've actually started to build a little bit of a fleet now. I can't believe we just managed to win. That was clutch. Hey, we can get gene clinics. I guess we'll research it in the hope that it helps with the event. It is now supremacy time. We found an empire. Um, war is on the horizon. And because we researched gene clinics, it actually did help. We are self-sufficient. Having mastered the secrets of genetic engineering, our people are now able to build gene clinics, like the ones left by the invaders. It's a glorious day for our people. Proof that we need no grappler holding to reach the stars. End the out of warranty event chain. We get some unity and declining healthcare is removed. That was worth it. We also just got Archeo studies very, very early. So we're going to get that. Dating. Taking back control. We've gained complete control of the derelict warship system. We now must decide what to do with it. Depending on our needs, it could be a powerful asset for either war or research. It allows us to restore the warship into either a flagship or habitat. It begins the restoring the warship event chain. And we get two projects. As you know, we are going for the warship. But in another video coming out soon, we will do the habitat, which is actually cheaper by half. And let's start researching the flagship. We might need it against uh, some soon to be slavers or whatever they are, who knows. Incoming transition, debt collectors. Dear Toxic Vengeance, we are contacting you on behalf of the Minmar Specialized Industries regarding an outstanding debt. Being a fledging spacefaring society, we understand you may not be in a position to repay the full amount. Our aim is to aid you in selecting an appropriate repayment plan, one which will sell any outstanding debts within stifling economic growth. Accordingly, we are happy to offer you a consultation free of charge. It is our ardent wish that this matter can be settled amicably. Uh, who are you? Even before our people first reached the stars, we understood that everyone has a role to play in this galaxy. Some cultures crave power, others pursue knowledge. We evolve to favor service. The one who has never felt the joy of unselfish service has missed the very theme of life. Bow down is not to be diminished, it is to uplift those around you. Mm. Well, I'm refusing to pay because we would not. With this, <laughs> there's no way we would do that. We're truly sorry that we are unable to reach an agreement in this matter. Is there any chance you would be willing to reconsider? to the terms of the contract is a debater is unwilling to unable we're required to seize assets on behalf of our client um they will attack us let's reconsider our options we can either pay the full amount which is 1.4 million energy credits we can pay 5,000 energy every five, 15 years 2,500 every 15 1 as 250 every 15 um no or we can give pops so they're asking for slaves crack term is undented servants well, I'm refusing to pay. Let's bring it on. This could be bad. We don't actually have a fleet. It'll be fine. What's the worst that can happen? Oh, oh they boy. did spawn. They have 700 strength and they're just sitting there. Oh, they're bombing. Well, let's try and build up a little bit before we attack them. We do get bonuses against people who are stronger than us. Wait for the gun battery, I think. One more Corvette can be built. Okay, let's stop them now. This should be an easy win, actually. Not today. Once again, we force the debt collectors to retreat from our home system. It's unlikely we've seen the last of them, but for now, our people and our assets are safe. It will return on 2031. We will be ready because we will have a ship this time. No, they took... Oh, these... This empire just took this system. I wanted that. Very annoying. Oh, it stopped our progress. Ah, oh, you mother druggers. We are starting to recover our technological data. We get assembly patterns and unity, which means we can start going down supremacy. Please say it resumed. No, I don't think it did. Wow. <laughs> Restored flagship. The retrofit of the former MSI warship is complete. We now have at our disposal a vessel of massive power and significance. Watch out, galaxy. Excellent. A 2.1k flagship. It does not have loads of things, but as we progress in the game, it also levels up with us, which I think is pretty cool. And we'll give this uh, experience lead again as well, just to get a massive leader on it. Structures. Can we actually design it? No. 
So we can't design it, which is annoying, but some things don't get in life. Steady infected systems have been found. We'll fight our right to exist. They are quite big. My consumer goods is not, not looking too good. It is not looking good. I'm trying to fix it. We only have two planets so far. That's that's the issue we have. Don't worry, I am eyeing up um, getting another planet. That could be good. Great Swolfins are here. Hello. They're at war with the Estidi. That, mm, that could be very good for us. That could be I'm some free real fine. estate. If I do say so myself. Diane Trade Association? I find everyone there. How do you do? Okay, so usually I don't just kill primitives straight away. But, you know, we need economy. We need pops. Oh, yeah. Estidi are claiming us. You're literally dying. Oh, very nice. We have uh, done a little bit of invading. Oh, they're just being purged. I don't think we should just completely purge them, to be quite honest. We need the... Uh... Oh, are they hive? Oh, they're hive. No! <laughs> that... We shouldn't <laughs> We should have invaded them then. I don't think there's any way they can beat me back with... Oh, the only issue is I can't see anything. We'll just claim as much as we can. But we do have our warship, Horatio the Bad, leading it. We just need... We need just something. Okay, it's wartime. Oh, we can actually make them a tributary. Oh, but I have the claims. Ah, let's make them a tributary. I want taxes because we can't do anything with the pops anyway because they're a hive. Makes sense. Let's see the warship in action. Look at it go. Scientific the circle maneuvers. This changed, but I don't know what to. Like 3k now. Oh, this empire below us was um Broken Shackles origin. That's pretty cool. I haven't had that happen yet. We're going to just declare them rifle though. We need as much uh, influence as possible. Oh no, they're going to beat us to it, I think. Please lose. Oh, no. Unless I declare war on the Swolfins, <laughs> I could maybe kill the Astidia as well. I'm just getting loads of ships from events as well. That's uh, nice. Okay, so the play I have to do here is I have to declare war on the Swolfins. Or they're going to take the Steady as a vassal. Um, let's claim their capital. We can do a war. Conquer them. Stop them taking over and hope that we win this. I believe we can just whack on exotic gas bonuses and hope that we win this. Oh, our corvettes are dead. But our sh warship... Our warship holds the Battle of the Ages, I believe, in the 3K. They retreated while uh, <laughs> they were pop up. No, they are oh, no. <laughs> I forgot they were coming again. Well, we're not paying. Our we sent our 1.5k back. You know what's funny? We haven't even found the uh, MSI. Once we deal with these wars, we will. Yep. Primacy is finished. We'll go share destiny so we can get more vassals because that will help us a lot. Oh no, they pieced out. Not too Battle bad. We only lost joined. one planet. Glorious. Like the Swalpins only took one. Forever indebted, the debt club does depart from a home system, but a deep sense of dread still lingers. They're giving their dedication to their employer. They will never stop harassing us, even if we somehow manage to repay the full sum. They'll come up with something else. Interest rates, legal loopholes, small print hidden in documents we won't remember signing. We can't buy back our freedom. We'll have no choice but fight for it. The question is how, with weapons or wood? We will go through warfare. Make them pay. We defeat them once, and we can do it again. But it won't be easy. The first time... They weren't expecting us to fight back. Now they will attack us with full might of their fleet. To have any chance, we must bide our time and prepare ourselves. This is a battle we cannot afford to lose. Can I use the payback castus belly Claire War? So if you're speed running it, you need to wait for the second uh, attack. But we don't actually know where MSI is. Um, I and mean, we will try and find them. That's easier said than done. Why won't the Steady piece out? Katrina. Is there a planet here? Oh, it's because I claimed that that I don't have. Well, I'll just unclaim it. But I do kind of want it. <laughs> it's too late now. Oh, no. Uh, we can still get it, I think. Uh-oh. They engaged us. Scientific breakthrough achieved. If we lose the warship, I'll be very sad. Oh, we got here with our corvettes. There we go. We have a loyal vassal who will provide us with all we need. And our economy should be fixed. Kind of. Yeah, I'm just going to set up the status quo with them. I want to vassal them in the future. I want to dig all their planets. And we've actually stolen some of their Scientific pops, which means we can settle a few more planets. We really need to find MSI, though. It'd be funny if they're just dead. Oh, we have an event. Oh, <laughs> we could have upgraded our flagship a while ago. Whoopsies. We finally built Argue Studies thing because our economy was not in a good shape. Oh no, the Swalpins are going to take this. I've found the dwarves. The only issue with being evil, it's hard to actually find people, but maybe we can bribe. Nobody wants Scientific to do communications with an evil person, action. apparently. That's GPT, EP20, Mold of Republic, the Nam. If the MSI are dead, I will laugh. Uh, <laughs> I don't see them. Come on. How would... <laughs> Is this them? The only one I've not found? Probably. No, in my life. Oh, there they go. It's contact with the Minmar Specialist Industries. Ah, how strange are the workings of the universe that we should come into contact with another again. After all that has transpired, 
but never fear. On behalf of the board, Minmar Specialist Industries stands ready to assist you again. Of course, we cannot simply overlook the damages incurred to company property. Our collection agents will no doubt be in contact with you soon. They haven't done so already. We hope we will be able to reach an amicable settlement. We live in such interesting times, don't you think? Allow me to be the first to congratulate you on the incredible progress your people have made. Look forward to testing how much you've grown. Keep out the way or we will make you. Yeah, we are um, going to murder them. Okay, now this ship is finally staying still. We can actually try and upgrade. It takes 10 months. Quest. So this is what the flagship looked before. And we've upgraded it. Let's see what changed. Now 5.8k. It was 7.7k. Oh, a lot more armor. Hangar 2s and loads of kinetic batteries. That's pretty good. Let's declare rivalry on Minma. We need to try and um, get some vassals. Only issue is this assembly we could vassalize, but they've got independence guaranteed. Swolfin, we can't yet. These are equivalent. Mm. Need to make sure we don't go to war when debt collectors. We've got nine years. Oh, we can just propose subjugation instead. Of course. Wait, what? Did they literally become a. Oh, they became a vassal as I submitted that. That's annoying. And the Minmar have a defense pact with the United States Postal Service. Perfect. Okay, we can get one down here. This is just what this game goes into. <laughs> just get as many vassals as you can. They said no. What? You literally just said yes. Oh no, they've federated. I can actually make them a tribute. Who's even in this federation? Darnish Kingdom. And not Minmar. Okay, Minmar's not in that. That's good. My plan is to kill the Swolfins and then Scientific kill the Minmar because we won't be able to get achieve. through. Oh, and they're... Oh, no. Why are you preparing to war me? What if we're just nice to each other? Remember we got that big common enemy? Minmar, we could kill the Minmar together, maybe? Well, that'd just be great. No. <laughs> They're coming. Why? <laughs> I don't want this war. <sighs> do I just become the crisis and meme everyone? No, we'll do RQ. Ah, no, we'll do Galactic Force Projection. Okay, We're almost clear. at the do not do this. Oh, it's stupid. Achieved. You know what? I think we could kill the Swolfins with just the special ships we've unlocked. Oh, and my please. Corvettes can just hold against them. We have 26k. Ah, why am I against the whole entire Federation? <laughs> stupid aim. I'll just take Federations in. It might actually be worth just surrendering this war. Because they only want two claims, which is these two systems, which don't really do anything for me. I mean, they are running away, though. We would never retreat. We would take them out with so our capital ship. Hey, hopefully. Because that cruiser just died. The longer the battle goes on, we do have hangers. Scientific we'll be doing more and more damage. Oh, and we're fighting them here. Well, that's always going to win. Ah, uh, on the deck clip. It's only 2k. This is a meme. We've won here as well, though. Deck collectors are dead. Oh, and now they've declared Our war on us. <laughs> are you war. serious? Everyone in the galaxy at war with poor little old me. How are you even going to get me? You're pathetic. Literally pathetic. I can't get to them, so I do need to make these a tributary, and they've got defense attack. Well, they'll just be in every single war we possibly can. Why not? Oh, I should probably set impose ideology payback. That's what we want. Oh, they've got 10k. What? 15k even. I really just want to surrender from that war, but I won't. I'm stubborn. Oh no. We actually are losing this one. Uh, okay, we're about to kill the Swolfins, and then we can kill MSI. We're just holding on here. Oh, <laughs> we were just holding there. Um, do we hold 20k versus 15? No edicts on. We have to try, I think. Let the Starbase tank. Make them retreat, maybe. Ah, uh, I think we just surrender. They were only taking two. Yeah, I don't care. It's a tactical retreat against Swolfins and stuff. Oh, we just switched places perfectly for the Corvettes to take that out. And then our other ship was taking those out. Okay. We have to somehow kill the Inari who are all the way trapped there. And chat GPT who are all the way over there win that war. We're just going to go kill MSI. Our that's what the main aim of this video was. And that's what we're going to do. Wait, what, where have all our Corvettes actually just gone. Oh, their star base is apparently strong. And they have 10k. <laughs> oh, this game. And the Swolfins now have 12k. Out of where? I have no idea. Okay, hopefully we can take out the Swolfins here. We'll be using the Edict. Oh, shoot. They've respawned back here. Might be able to take them out with just the warship, though. Yeah, we did. Okay, their star base is very strong, and our corvettes will melt against them, I think. So I think we want to just send our 
warship against them because that's better at dealing with bigger ship we'll see all that's are here to save it if needed okay I, oh no it seems we actually need frigates to deal with star bases or we just go cruisers they have so many star bases that are very strong that's annoying very annoying wait what how did they get over here <laughs> what oh they're actually coming from behind oh this game <laughs> As you can tell, I'm quite rusty. I haven't played in weeks due to circumstances. More info on the community page if you were wondering where I went. The deck collectors are back again. Ambushed. Oh, this, this is not good. Oh, they literally just closed borders on us. At least they did it just in time for me to take it back. Okay, it's time to kill MSI. I've had enough. The issue I have is I have to keep killing the small fence. And they're preparing to declare war on us. They have a lot. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Please no. We are friends. We should probably rush Minmar down because I'm probably just going to die to this empire who should hate Minmar specialists but have been killing me the whole time. Oh, 12 and, and they're dead. I thought I was trying to vassalize them, but whatever. All right, please actually win against this starbase. It does so much damage to me. These starbases. Oh my god. I'm literally gonna die! Please, no! <laughs> Please don't. <sighs> yeah, I kind of played a bit too slow, that's for sure. And I probably shouldn't be spamming Corvette. Gone. Okay, well, I think we have to go in because we're just gonna die if I don't. This is probably gonna get us killed. Uh, this time I'm sending the frigates in first. Go, go, go! Please. I think we're winning. We lost all our frigates. And we've been declared war on. Why? What's it even for? It's to make me a subsidiary, of course. They're just going to brush into me. We must kill MSI before we die. That's the mission. We actually have taken out their big star bases. It's fairly possible. Oh, I say we go for it. Kill them. Our frigates are here. Go, go, go. It's only a 10k. Come on, don't lose everything. I beg you, don't die. Okay, heal up, and then we can go for the final push. Are we dying? We yeah, we're dying. The There's a lot of us to kill, though. We have a citadel. We cannot fight them Enemy when their fleet's there, but they just left. Okay, well... Oh, they came to fight us here. With one fleet, now they're back. I'm constantly reinforcing. Okay, we go round. Oh, we can't. Okay, we go while there's then not a lot of them. Go, go, go. The time is now. We they have an orbital ring enemy as well. Take out as much as you can. Oh no. Come on, warship. It's almost doing it. It's doing it. It's doing it. It's doing it. It did it. They have 700 armies. You have to be kidding me. I don't have a big enough army to invade. No. No. I'm actually trying to get our ships there. We're clearing a path. Now we just need enough transport before we die. <laughs> Which is soon. Oh no. I am dying from a cough as well. But I think we do do is go take out. Port. Oh, it's 12k as well. We're just going to die. We're so close. Once they get the on the Hyperlee network, they get hit instantly almost. But we're also almost dead. Come on. Oh, gone. they're rebuilding the stupid star bases. Oh, we can't get Battle through because of that. Job. We would have been able to do it as well. Do I think we just have to land. <laughs> Come on. Beat them. We have a general. Enemy. They don't. No. How are they winning? I can't believe I've actually lost the flipping MSI. <laughs> <laughs> I am so rusty. Okay, what happens if we set up this street? Oh, lost. yeah, we get kicked out of the wall. Well, playing hyper-aggressive didn't really work, and I also suck at it. Um, I'm a filthy tech crusher. I was extremely rusty as well in this game. I haven't played for a while. We'll see how I do with the science habitat in the next video, which you can click here if it's already out. If not, the algorithm will decide for you.